Kaboom! Yes, guys, welcome to the channel and to my base review series. And this is the base we're going to be reviewing today. It's another nasty centralized town hall base. These bases are doing really well in the Legend League at the moment. Loads of one star attacks. So, what we're going to do is watch a replay so you can see the base in action, see how it performs. We're also going to discuss what are the best clan castle troops to use for this base and how the base actually performed in the Legend League. Yeah, guys. So, remember to hit that subscribe button and notification bell if you want to see plenty more awesome base designs and attack strategies anyway queen walk activated she's making her way into the base so it's hog miner hybrid now the only danger here of course is how are you going to take out the town hall the queen i don't think the queen can there's no way the queen can take out that town hall there's simply too many defenses there it's going to be too difficult so it's got to be the hogs and the miners that take out the town hall but at the moment of course town hall 14 you've got that poison bomb I just think it's really difficult because uh, hogs and miners don't have much health. You've got to try and protect them in the core with the Grand Warden ability. And they're going to struggle because they're going to get stuck in the core with that poison bomb. So what's going to happen here? Now, anyway, sorry, we've, the Queen's gone. Uh, but siege machine over on the right hand side there. Troops making their way towards the town hall. What's going to happen, guys? And just we're going to summarize now quickly how the base did in the Legend League, by the way. So over a three day period in the Legend League, there were 20 attacks against the base. Of those 20 attacks, one was a zero star, six were one star, and 13 were two star. Yeah, guys, impressive. Nobody's damaged the town hall yet. The Royal Champion is going for it, but uh, the, the Unicorn and the Royal Champion have been infernoed, and the Royal Champion's gone, and the Unicorn has just stepped onto a giant bomb. The Unicorn's gone as well, and I don't think anybody's going to make it to that town hall now. And guys, this is just a really nice base to use, and the town hall's just been frozen. Larry the Lava Hound's out, being annoying, flying around. And our clan castle troops, guys, are going to be one lava hound, two headhunters, and three archers. Magnificent. And, uh, yeah. Uh, is that it, guys? Two seconds left. Where's Larry the lava hound going? I don't know. So there we go, guys. Hope you enjoyed the replay. We're going to give the base a score out of 10 in just a moment. Before we do, just a quick reminder on this channel, we've got something called channel memberships. That's where you can help support the channel on YouTube. And in return, you get certain perks, such as an awesome badge next to your name, and at least once a month, a professional base design, which I'll share with you. Amazing, guys. All the information about joining in the video description. Anyway, out of 10 today, then, guys, we're going to give this base 9 out of 10. Yes. Magnificent base design. Its performance was fantastic. Thank you very much again guys hope you enjoyed the video remember to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell join the samus army yes guys we're almost at 100,000 subscribers thank you very much i'll see you later take care